into its second century, but still one of the best around Fenway Park here in Boston. We've got an AL East contest tonight between the New York Yankees and the Boston Red Sox. Edwin Encarnacion now. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. Leading off tonight for the Yankees, the first baseman, Edwin Now here's the pitch. And here's a called strike to the 36-year-old veteran. It's nothing in one. And this is high, a ball and a strike. Temperature here at game time, a comfortable 75 degrees tonight. Hit back up the middle. Throw in time as he's called out on a bang-bang play at first. So one away here with the bases empty. And up next, the left-handed hitting Brett Gardner. Gardner. First delivery to him on the way. The fastball here is he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. One out, nobody on. Called strike, and he's behind one and two. And great extension as he drives this one high in the air and deep the other way. Martinez is back to the warning track, and he's able to put it away for the second out. Batting third. Here's the second, the second baseman, base. D.J. LeMayhew. DJ first chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. First pitch coming. Here it is. And here's a fastball called for strike one. Oh, he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Now here it comes. And on 0-2, he misses with a fastball. Boy, it's hard to sit on an 0-2 fastball. I think that pitch just locked him up a bit. But lucky for him. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Here's J.D. Martinez. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. For the Red Sox. The left fielder, J.D. Here comes the first pitch. Martinez. Nope, Too low, down. one and zero. Oh. Two balls and no strikes Outside, down to the Red ball. Sox left fielder. Here's Sabathia on two and zero. Oh. Strike taken as that one catches the outer part of the plate. Set to deal on two and two. A swing by Martinez, and this is driven to left. And out of here, and I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. So the bases are clear now following the home run. And that'll bring in the veteran catcher, Sandy Leon. Outside target here, and he hits it for strike one. Oh, he looks like he's toying with him here. It's 0-2. Hey, after giving up that extra base hit right there, I love the fact that he came back with much better location, One ball, much strikes, better execution. Yeah. That might have woke him up. 1-2 and two to the Red Sox catcher. No outs, nobody on. Heading out towards shallow right. Judge is going to get there. Makes the play. One away. So digging in now. Mitch Moreland. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. Way off balance hack that time. Good for the first strike. 
hey, he's going to have to set his sights a little bit more over the heart of the plate. I can't have one of my best left-handed power hitters reaching and taking an ugly swing like that. Here's the 0-2 from Sabathia. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Hicks on the move. He gets there, and that's the second out. So bases are empty four. here with two gone. That's and that'll bring up the versatile oh. utility man, Brock Holt. Now the first pitch from CC. Yeah. Cut fastball in there for Hold a called strike. Count. Line towards center field. But this will not get down quickly enough as it's pulled in out there in center, and that ends the inning. So here's the cleanup hitter, Austin Romine. Leading He'll be the, the one game. to lead it off against the David Price here in the inning. Austin. Ready with Romine. the first pitch. Here it comes. A shot down the first baseline. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0 and 1. The wind up and the 0 1. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Stays alive, still 0 and 2. The 0 2 once more. Neither guy giving in here, and they'll do it again. Price ready with another 0 2. Weekly hit to third. Devers fields it cleanly. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. Standing in, Didi Gregorius, and he's got that batting lineup near the 300 mark entering play. First delivery to him on the way. No balls in one strike. Red Sox on top in the early going. One nothing as we play the second. Swung on and missed. That's strike two. Every time you go out there to start a game on the mound, you hope to settle in quickly and get into a groove, and he's definitely done that so the far in the early going. Looks like he could go pretty deep into this one. They try to come in with the fastball, but it's too far in, and it's even at two and two. Kind of pitching him backwards in this A.B. Soft stuff early, then those last two were fastballs trying to get it right by him. The 2-2 two -two one more time. And there's a fastball well off the plate inside. As a veteran pitcher, he knows if he's going to have success in this one, he's got to establish that pitch in, get those guys to respect it, and open up that outer half of the plate. And he looks at one that misses, and that's an excellent job of making his man throw a lot of pitches as he toughs out a walk. Now the first pitch here from Price. And he gets a piece of this one to foul it toward the backstop. Hit out toward second. He's got it. Ah, uh, flip of his glove for one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. Riding in for Boston, Xander Bogarts. Leading off. He's set to lead off the off home half of the second. Not shortstop. Xander. Bogart. Here comes the first pitch. Nearly inside got the one. inside, but ruled the ball. Now a swing and a fly ball. Judge is under it. And that's the first down of the inning. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And in to hit next, it'll be the left-handed batter, Jackie Bradley Jr. Jr. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Too much bite on the breaking ball that time as it's well off the outside. One off pitch is a sinker swung on and missed one and one. Hey, that was a nasty pitch right there. It's the depth of a sinker. Sometimes it's a matter of whether or not it's nope, moving east-west, but that one right there had such good downward action. Great pitch. 
snatched out of midair at first base for route number two. Sharon Riding Cup. into the box, the Mickey White Betts Bill. will try to make Mickey. something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Sabathia into his motion. Here's the first pitch. Aye. And Sabathia gets ahead here with the changeup. It's nothing and one. That pitch was right down the heart of the plate, but obviously this guy had made up his mind on the on-deck circle. He was taken all away. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Into the box, Aaron Judge, as we are all set to begin the third inning in this one. Number 99, Aaron. Infield in the overshift here, now the pitch. Now a fastball to start the third. That misses, it's ball one. Judge is simply an all-around great defensive outfielder. Not only does he have great range, there's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. And it bangs off the monster. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. So coming to the plate, Aaron Hicks, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. First offering on its way. And he'll just fight this one off as it's chopped foul. Off oh, the plate, out. one ball, one strike. The one two slapped hard the opposite way and that's in there base hit and they'll get it in quickly it's first and third now with nobody out stepping up to the plate Kyle Higashioka as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third first delivery to him on the way ball one the cutter runs outside ball one Runs outside, yep, so it goes to 2 0 now. Boy, he better get it back together here quick because he's got two guys on already. He's starting to lose location of that strike zone. He's got to throw a strike oh. right here. 3 and 0 now. Hey. 3 and 1. Three, three and one. one with two on, and this is where you, you got to be geared up for something to drive. I don't think you can just groove in one right here. You still have to try to make a competitive pitch. Runners at the corners here, nobody out. Three balls three and run. two strikes to the Yankees' DH. Can't lose, ball. With two strikes now and a runner at first, do you go for the strikeout? Or are you still looking for the double play ball? Well, Matt, I think a lot of that depends on the type of pitcher that you are. If you're a power pitcher, you can go ahead and ride a fastball up in the zone. But if you're a guy that induces a lot of ground balls with a sinker, I think you have to stick with that plan. Ready for another chance? Edwin Encarnacion. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Come set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. One -oh. Off speed pitch in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. Whoa, and maybe up. a little frustrated on the mound here as the fastball misses for ball two now. With the infield back and a runner at third, he's definitely pitching for a strikeout Aye. or maybe something like a harmless pop-up. You could see it from that high fastball, but that was just a good job of laying off that pitch. Goes the other way and sends it deep down the right field line. And now he scales the wall and makes an unbelievable catch. Digging in for his second at bat, Brett Gardner. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. Gardner. Now we'll step off and fire no, to the back. Safe. And he'll get back in safely. Here's the first pitch to him. Hey. A high fastball is in there. You know, Matty, when I first broke into the league, you wouldn't see that high heater first pitch right out of the gate. But I think there's been a change in, in philosophy here. 
back in the late 90s, early 2000s, guys wanted to attack you more east-west, get you leaning left-right. Now you're seeing He's guys going. attack in the philosophy more north-south. Hot shot to first base and a great play to end the inning. Stepping into the box, Rafael Devers. And he comes in as a player to watch out for, hitting well over 300 on the season. Ready with the first pitch, here it comes. Unable to find the zone with the slider. Hit on the ground down the first baseline, but a foul ball, one and one. Two and oh, one. That's out. Looked right. like he got fooled on the speed there. Two and two. The two two. He stays alive. Still two and two. Swing and a liner toward the gap in left center. Gardner will slide over and put this one away. And that's out number one. Set to get his evening at the plate started. Christian Vasquez batting just a notch below 300 so far on the season. First pitch of the at bat. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. Looking at his lifetime numbers, Vasquez brings a batting average just a little over the 250 mark. A one and one count now to Vasquez. He's looking really great on the bump right now. I mean, it's been a while since he's allowed a base runner, and he just jumped ahead of another hitter right there. A ball and two strikes now. The one two. Into center field, line drive base hit. Number nine batter comes through that time as it'll now be up to the top of the order with one away. So a runner at first with one man gone. And into bat next, one of the best run producers in the lane, J.D. Martinez. Here comes the first pitch. Runner on first here with one gone and a 1-1 one -one tie. Really one one. pulled that one across as the slider misses well inside. I know he buried that slider in right there, but that's a dangerous pitch. If he doesn't pot commit and bury that inside, it leaks out over the plate. He can get hurt with that pitch. And now it'll kick around in the corner. And he is in oh. there. Hey. Digging in to try it again. Man. Sandy Leon fly down in his Sandy. first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. Yeah, give me the same at bat. As you stride to the plate right here, give me the same execution. Ah. Just get All something in, in the air. You got a chance to take the lead right here. Don't try and do any more. Hey, that's a huge pitch right there. You've got to get ahead. When you start to see traffic on the base nope. pass, your defense starts to tighten up a little ball, bit. The best thing to do is pound the zone and get ahead all one. Ready with the 1-1 one -one pitch. And well, this one awesome. runs a little too far in, ball two. A lot of times you see guys get too aggressive and try to do too much at the plate with guys on, but right here he's doing a great job of waiting on the right pitch. Got himself ahead in the count now. Runners are at first and third, one away. And Sabathia misses here. It runs full now, three and two. With the meat of the order due up next, you could probably expect to see something you can handle here with the full count as the two-hole hitter. Oni pops it up. LeMahieu ranging into shallow right. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Up next for the Red Sox. There's the first, the baseman, first baseman now, baseman. Mitch Moreland. Two Mitch. on, two out for him here in the third. Right. Looking to wiggle out of this. Here it is. Oh, that's out. Here's a first pitch slider that just tails out of the zone. It's ball one. Popped up. 
Encarnacion waits on it. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. Digging in, D.J. LeMayhew. He got called out on strikes his last time through. Yeah, always frustrating to go down looking. Everybody does it, though. You'll have a few A.B.s where you get completely fooled. Look for him to be on the attack early in the setback. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. 0 oh, 1. Now a change up, but it misses just a little below the zone. Oh, and he two. lays off it to even the count 2 and 2. Swing and a liner, but foul. The 2-2 two -two one more time. Hot shot to third and handled for the first out. So the base is empty here with one away. And up next, the catcher, Austin Romine. First pitch on its way. Oh, trying to check his swing there as this is hit to the left side. But a foul ball here, 0-1. He's been doing a nice job out there on the mound, but the deeper you get into the game, the more the hitters have one seen ball, you. This is the part of the lineup that he has to be really careful with. One and two to the Yankees catcher. This guy has been throwing the ball so well, and that's exactly why. He has such a feel for that secondary pitch. He can flip that it over two. whenever he wants and get back in the count. Even count, two balls and two strikes. Another try at 2-2. He takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. How about it? So two are gone now in the Yankee half of the fourth. And here's the left-handed hitting shortstop, Didi Gregorius, now. That one's right down the middle for a strike with the fastball. Oh, that's for sure going to be a pitch he wants back. You're not going to get many balls right in the wheelhouse from a top-level arm like this. Behind 0-2 now. Now the 0-2 from Price. Nope. Down and ball away, one. it's a ball and two strikes. I love a well-executed changeup, especially one down in the zone. The only problem throwing it in that situation, you leave that belt that high two two. or miss your spot just a hair, and you could have some problems. in the air now out to right field. Betts giving chase. He tracks it down and that will end the inning. Here's Brock Holt now. Hit it hard but lined out Leading in his off. first at bat. Well, no, yeah, off. Matty, but as he walks the to the plate base, right man. here, he feels Whoa. good building off that last oh. A.B. He hit that ball on the screws. Right ah. back to work is Sabathia as he gets ahead of the first batter here. Nothing in one. This is pulled into right. Judge is there, and he makes the catch for the out. Into the box no now, batter. Xander Bogarts. He Short flew stop. out in his last at-bat. Here comes the first pitch. Trying to work oh, that slider out. to the outer half, but it misses 1-0. Hit in the air down the right field line. And foul. Outside, outside, two and one. You know, what I'm seeing here is a reluctance to throw the fastball. It's like he feels he can't throw the ball right by him right now. All even now, two and two. One run on three hits and no errors for the Red Sox to this point. And Sabathia misses here. It runs full now, three and two. 
Three two counts are usually a time to challenge the hitter, but I think he'll be careful here. Shoot for the corner, and if you miss and you walk him, so what? That's better than him putting one in the seats. And another foul ball. Another full count pitch home. And he looks nope. at one that misses, and that's an excellent job of making his man throw a lot of pitches as he toughs out a now wall. Batter, fielder, in now, Jackie, Jackie Bradley Jr. Bradley. Hit it hard, but lined out Jr. in his first at bat. Yeah, Matty, it's always a little frustrating when you square one up. You hit a solid line drive like he did, and all you have to show for it is a jog back to the dugout. That can get in your head for a little while. He's set. Here's the 0-1. Not one one. close with that one. It's way above the strike zone. Bradley, or JBJ as the initials read. This is his first year at the big league level. Oh, now a good damn. pitch around the knees, but it doesn't quite catch the bottom of the zone. Hold hard, but it's foul down the first base side. Bogarts stands at first with one out. And he'll snap one over to first. Hey. And a dive, but he's back in there. And now the count is we full for the Boston center strikes. fielder. Not a bad time right here to put that runner in motion. 3-2 count. You send the runner, and if it's a bad ball pitch, four, it's up. ball four. And he misses again here. It's ball four. And that's back-to-back back walks right here with one away. Okay. Go ahead. delivery to him on the way. Now both runners on the move. Hit in the air to shallow center. Under it, Gregorius. And that's out number two. Rafael Devers, the next to bat. Now He's bat. 0 for 1 the thus far. Baseman. Rafael Devers. Now the first pitch from CC. Nope. Ball that's one. Ball. Two walks in this inning already, so he can't expect to stay out there much longer if he puts somebody else on. We'll see if he can find it. And a strike to even the count. One and one. Hey, I don't mind that batter taking that strike right there. He's walked a couple people early in this game. Got to find out if he can find his own. If he wants to walk them all in, we'll take it. Two balls and a strike now. Took a good cut that time, but comes up empty. Two and two. In the dirt, but swung on and missed. And the throw to first ends the inning. Eduardo Rodriguez, a six-foot, two-inch left-hander, jogs in to take over on the hill. Eduardo Rodriguez. That'll bring in Giovanni Urshela. Leading off for the Yankees. The third baseman, Gio Urshela. First delivery to him on the way. Aye. Fastball taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. Rodriguez is at least partially known for a good changeup, and it's not just any change of speed pitch. It dances all over the place. The windup and the 0-2 pitch. Nope. Ball one taken just off the inside. Great arm action on that two strike changeup right there, but even better job at the plate to take that one. That's in. Ball two. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. The 2 2. Count remains 2 and 2. Down the first baseline, but a foul ball as it holds it 2 and 2. Ready with another 2 2. Now, oh, this is hit high and deep out to left. But he's going to haul this one in on the run as he winds up just shy of the wall for the first down. Here's big Aaron Judge. He scored a run after stroking a double in his first at bat. Oh, that's getting a guaranteed fastball. 
And that misses ball four now. It's a leadoff walk now to get the home half of no the West fifth Fielder. underway. J.D. First offering on its way. And a sinker gets too low there. there. Into the dirt, in fact. A line shot to third base, but the runner is back to avoid the double play. Now to the, the plate, Sandy Leon. He comes in Sandy. 0 for 2 thus far. Leon. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Now and 1 and a ball 1 and 0. That's a ball. 2 and 0. In today's game, everybody's trying to work off the mound north-south, trying to elevate that heater. He wanted that pitch right there, but I can tell you as an offensive player, I'd rather give you six inches off east-west than to have you call that high fastball. Now the 2-1. He's taken for strike two. Really feels like he's just on cruise control out there on the mound right now. Yeah, it really does, Matt, but this offense isn't helping him too much. It sort of feels like the next team to score is going to win this thing. And he is safe at second base as the decision to move up pays off, and that'll likely be scored a wild pitch. Now the three and two pitch. Popped up. And that's in there. Base hit. Throw comes in to third now, so they're at the corners here with only one out. The batter. The first Runners hit the corners here with Mitch. one guy in the inning. And that will bring up a former gold glover, the first baseman, Mitch Moreland. First pitch coming, here it is. And that's in there for a strike. Hey, it's not always about filling up the strike zone all the time every inning. He's pitching well as we're moving into the middle innings, but interestingly, less than 50% of his first pitches have been for strikes. Taken, but that catches the inside part of the plate. With two strikes and the runners at the corners, this is a big pitch coming up. Got to execute to hope to either get a strikeout or a double play ball to help you get out of this thing. Throw to first, not in time as the run is across the score. Ready once again. Brown Colts over two base. on his line thus far. Four. He's set and the pitch. Nope. Ball one. Good deception on the slider there as he's way out in front. Ball, one strike. And ball, this ball strike. runs away from ball two. Two and one. After two breaking pitches, there's a pretty good chance right now you're probably going to get something right in the middle of the strike zone to swing it. So if you're looking for it, go ahead and turn that baby loose. One there. Relay to oh. first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. Stepping in, Kyle Higashioka. He's set to start it out for the game. Yanks here in the sixth. The designated hitter, Kyle Higashioka. First pitch of the at bat. Ah. Taken, and that one catches the bottom part of the strike zone. Bounce to first. And he'll take it oh. to the bag himself for the out. Digging in now, Edwin Encarnacion earned himself an RBI Edwin. with a sack fly his last time at the plate. First delivery to him on the way. At the ball. Low for ball one. Ball one, no strike. Low scoring game thus far, two to one here in the sixth. Lifted into the air to shallow center. Betts is over. He's got it, and there are two down now. Ready now, now Brett Gardner. It's no hits to this point. Brett Gardner. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Fastball in there for a call strike. 
Stay on the attack if you're the pitcher right here. You know who's lurking. Three, four, five, and you'd love to see yeah. that number three hole hitter lead no that next three. thing off. Behind 0-2 now. Now here it comes. Tries to go the other way as this is in the air to left field. And Bogarts will make the catch for the final out of the inning. Ladies David and Hale and enters to do the pitching please. in the bottom of the sixth. Now pitching for New York, number 75, David Hale. Here's Xander Bogarts now. Leading off for the Red Sox, the shortstop, Xander. First pitch of the at bat Bogart. on its way. Owen won the count. And here's a curveball in the ball, dirt that time for a ball. One and one. Count moves to a ball and two strikes now. He wasn't fooling anybody with that fastball. He barreled it up nice right there. He's just got to find a way to keep it fair. Now a breaking ball, but it's low. Swing and a miss as he couldn't connect on the two-seamer, and that's out number one. Here's Jackie Bradley now. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Swing and a miss, and he's behind 0 and 1. High and deep down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. Wind up and the 0-2 pitch. And he fouls this one off. Ball Not a bad pitch strike. there with two strikes, but it misses one and two. Hit sharply on the ground. LeMayhew's got it. And there's that He's number up. two. Here's Mookie Bass. Right fielder. Here's the first pitch to him. And he lays off a pitch in there for the first strike. To me, getting ahead 0 1, it's the most important pitch in the game, Matty. It puts the hitter on the defensive. I can only think of myself being in the batter's box. When I'm sitting 1 0, I am all over the gas, or I am allowed the opportunity to sit on something without fearing going one and He's the throw out. to first is there the inning is over welcome back to Fenway Park here in the great city of Boston Red Sox on top in this one as we get set for the seventh but first here's a look at our game summary to this point Your Matt Barnes please. takes the mound now, now and it appears he's being ball. brought in to face the right-handed batter who waits next. Matt. Yeah, you usually don't hear the term righty specialist very often, but that's kind of how they're using him here, Matt. Most hitters have a harder time against pitchers of the same handedness, so we'll see if this move pans out. Coming to the plate now, D.J. LeMayhew. Over two for him to this point. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. First pitch of the inning is taken downstairs for a ball. It's 1-0. and Ball two. You'll hear me say this time after time up here in the booth. You fight so hard to get into these counts. 1-0, 2-0, They don't happen often. This is a huge spot. Count leverage. Look for him to get loose on a fastball right here. The 2-1 home. Will not catch the zone. Three ball ball three. One strike. Down by a run, your guy needs to get on any way he can. His mentality has to be to shrink the strike zone to like the size of a soup can. No reason to swing at a pitcher's pitch. Great effort on the dive, but it's through into left. 
Next will be the cleanup hitter, Austin now Romine. Back. He looked to bounce back after Austin. striking out his last Romine. time up. Yeah, Matty, and hopefully he got it out of his system. Especially now, he's got to bear down. He gets the two strikes in this spot, has to put the ball in play. Aye. Drops in a strike to start the at-bat, nothing and one. Fouled away. Barnes, 28 years old. This is his first year at the big league level. High in the air and drifting out to shallow center. Bradley comes on now and he has it one down. So striding in, Didi Gregorius. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Here's the first pitch to him. Well, and that's high for a ball, 1 0. Ah. And he watches a called strike as this one bears in on him, 1 and 1. Not too often you see a changeup come across at 88 miles an hour on the gun. Still effective when you're throwing a fastball in the high 90s, though. The one two smoked on the ground up the middle and that gets through for a one out base hit standing in Gio now Urshela bad. 0 for 2 from base him base. so far in this one Gio Urshela. here comes the first pitch and this one's in the dirt. So now two men in scoring position. One out with the possible tying and go ahead runs on base here. Well they miss with the first one but then they decide let's go ahead and put him aboard here and they'll do just that as you see the signal from the dugout. Aaron. Go. First pitch on its way. Fastball on the first pitch and it's taken for strike one. Well, the Yankees have been searching for that big hit pretty much all game. It remains to see if they can get it, but now it sure would be ball, a good time. Out. Didn't quite catch the zone there, ball one. Took something off there as this pitch is in the dirt, oh, but handled great. quickly behind the plate. Oh, and he'll make it back in safely at third. Uh, this could be trouble now. It's Down three and one. one. Well, when the pressure starts to intensify, it often feels like the strike zone gets harder and harder to hit. This is a big spot here. Fouled off. Now the three and two pitch. Line drive. That's a base hit into the right center field gap. And they've come back to tie it up as it's now a 2-2 ball game. So now bases that. are loaded. No Nowhere field. to put him with one Aaron. away. And that'll bring up the switch hitter Aaron Hicks. From the stretch. Ball. The fastball here is he'll now take a look at ball one. One and oh. This game is getting interesting real quick. And the last thing you want to do on the mound is fall behind. Needs ball to get two. back in the strike zone right here. Two and oh. Too tight nope. with that one. That's three inside. and oh. Well, nothing can make you question yourself on that mound more than three straight balls to a guy you know that you should go right after. Sometimes you just lose the strike zone and you don't know why. Three and one the count now. Challenge pitch coming. Here it is. Eight, and it's up to a three two three full count now. Short. Could this be two? Oh, for one. Relay to first in time. And just like that, the sun is retired. Number 
Now in the box, Rafael Devers. He'll start off. things out here Four in the no, bottom of inning number seven. The third baseman, Rafael. Ready to deliver. Never. Here's the first pitch. Eight. And he gets the call that time for strike number one. Way inside with that one. A pretty easy take there. No offer yep, on that one. Two balls and a strike. Strike two called and it's even at two. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. Slapped hard the opposite way. Hicks has him played perfectly as he puts it away for round number one. One man is out of the, the Red Sox seventh. Seven. And from the on deck Dedicated circle hitter. into the batter's box Rich comes yeah. Christian Vasquez. Vasquez. First delivery to him on the way. Ball one. Pitch taken several inches below the zone, in fact. Eight. A high fastball is in there. Bases are empty, one man out. That's Two and one. Toward the gap in right center. This is going to be a base hit, and he may take that big turn at first. And this will kick up against the wall near the Red Sox bullpen. And he is in the second base with one away as the go ahead run. Now better. Riding in, J.D. Martinez. He launched one over the wall back in the opening frame. And the indication from the dugout comes. It looks like they're going to put him on intentionally. So that'll set up the double play possibility with one away. First offering on its way. There's a fastball well off the plate for a ball. And a ball and a strike now to Sandy Leone. Steal, now the steal. One one now both runners are breaking. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. The one two is taken for two. ball two. I think he's shown you right there. He was trying to put you away with the off speed pitch. Have to be leery of that right there and take pull side away. That'll keep you on all stuff, fastballs and the off speed. Judge is there, two down. Coming to the plate now, Mitch Moreland. Now He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. From the stretch. Ball. First offering to him stays ball upstairs. One, no it's a ball and no strikes. He pulls this one into right. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will end the inning. Your Heath Hembry please. has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 37, Heath Hembry. Next will be the designated hitter, Kyle Higashioka. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Higashioka. First delivery to him on the way. Front door with the slider eclipsed the zone for a called strike. And now a curveball that bounces up to the plate. It's one and one. The one one. Is swung on and missed for strike number two. One ball, two strikes. The one two lined hard toward right center. Bradley is right there, one down. So back to the top of the Yankee order, digging in, Edwin Encarnacion. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. 
Almost, Matty. Almost went deep his last AB. Certainly just That's missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this AB. Ball. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Outside. Ball. Three and zero oh now. And he nope, lays off, ball, ball four. four. Now the potential go-ahead run is on base here. Now time is called, and we'll have a pinch runner at first, and right. that'll be a wise decision as he's the potential go-ahead run. Here's Brett Gardner now. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. He's set. Here it comes. And oh, that misses inside, inside one and oh. This is a tough guy right here to hit into a double play. He's fast and he swings from the left side, so out of the box he's going to get a good break. He might have to try to get the strikeout right here because very rarely are you going to get this guy to ground into a double play. Two balls and a strike to count. Before the delivery, a check on that go-ahead run at first. And he'll get dirty, but he's back in safely. Possible go-ahead runs on first, one away. Three and one now to Brett Gardner. DJ LeMayhew is on deck. Now a throw over, and he's back easily. Lifted down the line and left. And this will wind up a foul ball. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Down the third baseline. A payoff pitch one more time. And he misses with it. Ball four. So the potential go-ahead run moves into scoring position now. The second baseman. Now at the plate, D.J. LeMayhew is working on a one for three thus far. Here comes the first pitch. Hit out towards second. Reined in to He's second out. for one. Oh. And Moreland, and they roll two to end the inning. Ladies Nestor Cortez Jr. is on the pitch out of the bullpen now in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 67, Nestor Cortez Jr. So here's the Boston cleanup hitter, Brock Holt. He was a double Four play victim shot. last time around. The second yeah, base rolling base. into a two Whoa. ball will eat at you for the rest Whoa. of the game at least. So you know he wants to make up for it right here. Swing and a looper to left. In there, a base hit. So it's a leadoff base hit to start the Red Sox half of the inning. So a runner at first no now with Number nobody out. And that'll bring Good up the stop. shortstop and one of the better Denver. two strike hitters in baseball, Xander Bogarts. He's first going. pitch of the at bat on its way. Seared oh. down the first baseline. And he'll look at a fastball just off the black, and it's even at one. One and two to the Boston shortstop. Tough two pitch ball. to lay off there, but he did, and it's even up at two and two. Oh, on the ground to first. Can this be two? There's Ow. one on to first, oh. and you can forget about the go-ahead run being on base. He's erased on the double play. Now batting. So striding forward now, Jackie, Jackie Bradley Jr. Bradley. He was a ground-out victim Junior. last time up. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. That one's right down the middle for a strike with the fastball. Pop straight up for Shella. Trying to get there. A dive and he brings it in. And on a fantastic play, the inning is over. 
Next for New York, Austin Romine. No Lead hits off. in three tries so far. He has struck out once. Austin Romine. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Here we go with inning number nine as the first pitch misses for ball one. Two and oh. Well, 2 and 0 now, and this is where he makes his money. If he gets a pitch to hack at, you can bet he's not going to hold back. All over the place to start the ninth. It's 3 and 0 now. And that's finally over for a strike. Swing and a liner. Foul. And a swing and a miss on the fastball. And there's the first out here in the ninth. Settling in now, Didi Gregorius. He singled his last time up. First delivery to him on the way. Turned on down the line. A dive, but it's off his glove. And he'll get in there safely. So stepping in, Gio Urshela. It's one away. The runner at first represents the potential go-ahead score. Double play is in order, however. Here's the first pitch. No balls and a strike to count. Possible go-ahead runs on first, one away. Down the left field line and deep. And this will wind up a foul ball. And the runner gets him swinging, two gone. Digging in and looking for more, Aaron Judge. There are two gone and the possible go-ahead run at first. Here's the first pitch. Fastball catches the black there for a called strike. Plays off the slider and it's one and one. And it's a two ball and two strikes now to Aaron Judge. One ball, two strikes. Yeah, yeah, Maddie. not only is this guy using all four quadrants, he's elevating, getting their eye level up with a quality oh, fastball. Ball, ball two. Can't find the zone there as he lays off the breaking ball. Breaking ball, ball called just strikes. a bit low. Good running count right here. Three balls, two strikes, two outs, run run first. He'll be off to the races on this pitch. And he strikes him out on a good pitch. So one run can win it as we head to the bottom of the inning. Your Luis Sessa please. enters to do the pitching. Now, and best case scenario sure. for him is Number to push 85. this one into extra inning. Now batting, Mookie Betts. He was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. Yeah, and he didn't put up much of a fight either, Matty. Got to find a way. Can't go down three pitches. I don't care if you're staring at him or swinging at him. You have to find a way to make this pitcher work a little bit harder. Number 45. Perhaps a little low there. It's 2-0. Oh. 2-1 and one now to Mookie. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Judges under it. And that's the first out of the inning. Stepping up now, Rafael Devers. He lined out in his last trip, so looking for better fortunes here. Yeah, he hit it hard. That's all you can ask. You can't control the results sometimes, Maddie. Just unlucky with the placement. One and oh, the count. count now a ball and a strike and he'll come back two with balls. one in the dirt one as the count moves to two and one now high and deep down the left field line and this will wind up a foul ball lifted the other way down the left field line and that will end up a foul ball the 2 2 one more time and it's fouled away making him sweat out there the seventh pitch coming up 
Weak grounder down the line at third. But this is going to be a foul ball as that keeps things at two and two. Three and two, the count for Rafael Devers. He's definitely going to want to get greedy in his own, and he's obviously seeing the ball well, or he would have swung it back. Sometimes in these long, epic at bats, you start to get into swing mode. The batter, number seven. Stepping in, Christian, Christian Vasquez. He's got a chance to. The inning is over. Colton Brewer please. takes the mound as now he'll be the first the man to pitch here in extra number innings. 54. Okay. Brewer. Digging in, Aaron Hicks. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. The left fielder, Aaron Hicks. First pitch on its way. And one, he starts no him out with one high and tight, ball one. Brewer playing here in his age 26 season. He's in his rookie year here at the big league level. He pulled the string and had him way out in front, a ball and a strike. And he fouls this one off. The one two pitch. Now here's a shot out toward the gap in right center. He's around first, heading for two. And your go ahead run is in at second base here with a leadoff double. Now that is. So a big spot here and stepping in Kyle Higashioka and he could very well get the intentional pass here as that would set up a potential double play ball that might keep the game tied. Here's the first pitch. A fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. This has to be a productive at bat right here. I know you want to drive the run in and get the RBI but you have to find a way bare minimum to move this runner over to third. Two and oh now. Now the 2 0. -oh. Right. Swing and a miss, 2 and 1. Go ahead, runs in scoring position here with nobody out. Hard on the ground towards short, and that's through into left, a base hit. And the go ahead run will move up to third and wisely hold there with the nobody out. The first baseman. Now at the plate, look, boy, he has the possible go-ahead run only 90 feet away at third base. Here's the first pitch. Now a fly ball, but far too shallow to get that run in. There to take it in is Bogarts, and that's the first down. Stepping into the box, Brett Gardner. And clearly this is a critical moment in this ball game. Go-ahead run at third with one away. Here's the first pitch. Nope, too okay. high. One and oh. Into the corner and slicing foul. The one and one pitch. And he lays off for a ball. Two and one. Swing and a fly ball. This ought to at least get the go-ahead run in. Bradley is there. Let's see if they test it. And they will not risk it. So with two away now, that go-ahead run is forced to hold tight at third base. Here's the first pitch. Strike taken up in the zone. Oh and one. And this catches the zone as well. It's 0-2 now. That's back-to-back -back pitches taken for strikes. Puts himself in a bad spot. 0-2. Let's see if he can battle back in this A-B. And, oh, this one's by him to the backstop. And a disastrous time to uncork a wild pitch as the go-ahead run scores from third. Here's oh, a breaking ball, but it doesn't quite find the strike zone. 
Well, that curveball just doesn't look to have the same snap on it that it normally does. Both of those last two have been pretty flat, and that's a pitch Full he count. relies three on coming two. in out of the bullpen. Full count, three and two. And ball four now as he'll take first on the intentional walk. Big spot here. First and second, two men gone. Austin. And up next, the catcher, Austin Romine. Looking to keep this a one-run game, the pitch. Ah. And a strike called at the knees, nothing in one. Hey. Hard stuff on the corner, and he's got him 0-2 now. Don't just assume as a hitter right here he won't triple up. He's got you down 0-2, and he might really want to get inside your head nope. if he throws the same pitch again. To 1-2 and two now. Ready with the 1-2. Fastball laid two off two. well below the knees. This is a huge pitch right here. I don't think he wants to go 3-2 and have those runners be in motion. Look for him to be aggressive with what he thinks is his best pitch right now. Fouled away. Two and two. Here it is. Tough curveball that time, but he's able to make a little contact to keep this end ball going. And he'll go the short way to retire the side. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention. So, with a safe situation on tap, they'll hand the ball over to a formidable force indeed. The very hard throwing left hander, Aroldis Chapman. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. J.D. Martinez. He homered earlier and is two for three to this point. Hey, it's never easy scoring runs against their closer, but this lineup is setting up perfectly right now as the leadoff hitter leads off this inning. Now a good pitch around the knees, but it doesn't quite catch the bottom of the zone. There's a swing and a ball lifted to left, but back in the seats, out of play. It's one and two. There's a swing and a high pop-up. And there's out number one. Striding in once again, Sandy Leone. He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one for four day. First offering on its way. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Swing and a miss as he ramps up on the fastball, one and one. Get it ready, big boy. This guy's throwing three digits right here. The best way I can help the fans is 90 to 92, you can usually see seams. 92 to 95, it starts to really quicken up on you. Over three digits, you're seeing a That's white a blur. Lays off two, two and two yeah. now. Ball three, three, three and two now. Well, the one two pitch didn't go his way, and now a miss there on two and two. You know he doesn't want this at bat to get away from him, so I think we're going to see a challenge pitch on a full count. Fouled off. One out, nobody on. The next three, two. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. And he lays off ball four. So now the potential time run here is aboard late in the game. At the plate, Mitch Moreland. They'll be looking for something he could drive into the gap and drive home that time run from first. First pitch coming. Here it is. Tried to check it, and it's 0-1. And he watches a called strike at the knees. No balls and two strikes. You know, the old adage is you never throw a lefty down and in because their ability to turn and burn. And this pitcher's taking that ball, to heart. Strikes, He's throwing everything away right here. The one and two pitch. 
swing and a miss on the fastball that time out number two. So a big moment here and standing in Brock Holt and he does so representing the possible go ahead run. Chapman sets here comes the first pitch. And he'll hold off on the slider here to start the at bat. It's ball one. Not two close. It's two and oh. That was one of the easiest takes he'll have all year, and it puts him in a great hitter's count. He's got to take advantage of this situation. Oh, they get him off balance there as he reaches for that one, but can't find it. It's two and one. A two swing ball. and a miss at the two slider strike. at 88. Two and two. Last strike now for the Red Sox. And he struck him out for out number three. So that'll wrap things up here as they leave the possible tying run stranded at first.